That's the day, guys. Thanks. Gallagher, you're still upright. Yeah. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> hey, who had to make it at the whole day? Not me. Oh, so the pool's mine. Now, fuck that. The pool buys us all around at the alibi. Yo, I'll get some bleach on that phone if I was you. Get him in the porter on for an hour. Shut the fuck up, Sullivan. <laughs> hey, we hit the showers, and then we go to the bar college. Unless you think you're too good to drink with all of us. I'll see you guys there, all right? All right. All right. All right, get the fuck out of here. It was a long shower. Oh, you pussied out. Ah, uh, well, might have been some phone sex with Miami. College. What are you guys building on top of the old nursing home? I don't build them, just demo. I'll tell you what it is. I'll tell you all what it is. It's a Starbucks. Or some sort of artisanal juicery or a whole fucking foods. Just drop it, Frank, all right? I'm talking about gentrification, my friends. Genital what? I'm talking about the beginning of the end. I have seen this before on Fulton Street in 64, on Kirby Street in 68. Realtors started buying up property at better than market value, and within a few months, the whole neighborhood was overrun with the gentry, and we were forced out. Today, the urban gentry is moneyed lesbians. They knock on your door, they offer you twice what your home is worth, and they do it because they know something you don't. He like this at home? Oh, you think I'd let him live in my home? <laughs> <laughs> laugh, laugh. You won't be laughing in a year when you won't be able to afford to live here. They move in, they take over. They kick the homeless out of the park as if they don't have a God-given right to sleep there. We are dinosaurs, my friend. And a big, fat comet is headed for our sweet slice of Earth. And that comet is a Starbucks. Holy shit. How do he know? What's going on? Told ya! Pacifier is supposed to be bad for babies now. Do you have children? Then shut the fuck up. Look who it is. Wrapping up his ghetto summer two or four heads off to the Ivy Tower. It's an ivory tower. All right, if you're gonna talk shit, at least do it right. I'm at it with you fucking Gallagher's. I just had a long day at work. Work? Mickey, you ever heard of that? I just came here for a fucking beer, all right? You built up a big thirst selling out your neighborhood, huh? Look, I don't like this place changing just as much as you. Yeah, except when the yuppie floodgates open, it's gonna be us out here drowning while you work on becoming a member of the future McMansion owners of America. I'm just as fucking south side as you are. Really? So what are you doing to stop these gap-wearing assholes from taking over the hood, huh? Jack shit, what are you doing other than running your fucking mouth? I'm gonna make this place even shittier. So no one will want to live here. Oh, yeah, how are you gonna do that? You gonna bury a radioactive waste? You gonna dump chemicals into the water? Carcinogens, DDT? Where do you think we can get DDT? In Vietnam, maybe. Fuck it. So we'll just have to go mess shit up here. Hey, go get the car, Reggie Sally. You in? As long as I don't gotta handle any radioactive waste. What about you, Southside? Put up a shut up. <laughs> they got the machines hooked up and everything. Yeah, all ready to make those non fat fagachinos. No offense, bro. Ooh, jar dust? Yes, even that. <laughs> no, I'm good. Stop standing around with our dicks in our hands, gentlemen. All right, give me the spray paint. Spray paint? Not TP in the goddamn principal's house, Philip. The M16 or the AK. Are you afraid you're gonna lose that McMansion? Don't give me the AK. On my signal, Rip Juan Valdez, a new fucking asshole. What's the signal? They're gonna have to do some more work before they open. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> 